out with it. Um, we're going to do a mail call and a shave review of what I just got in. So, today we're going to be using uh, Sapafinico. Sap I don't even know how the heck you say it. But, Sapafinico Verasano. And I got this after I saw Chris uh, Bailey's review, Khan's review, and Anthony Esposito's review. And I got the Aromatic Firm. So we just let it bloom here for a couple minutes, but I don't know if you guys are familiar with uh, Curve, the cologne. To me, it smells just like that, real nice. Uh, <clears throat> excuse me, scent-wise, we're at like a four right now. But I, I mean, it's 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 like very clean. It's a, like Curve and soap. Uh, it smells pretty good. So. That was a mail call that I got today that I was waiting to use. Also, I got their aftershave bomb or aftershave bomb and um yeah, aftershave bomb. This is the big boy that I got lucky on at eBay. It's a double duck gold edge. Really excited to use this. Hopefully the blade, I mean I tested it and the blade seemed to be cutting, so I don't know, we'll give it a whirl and see how it goes. And uh, so I'm going to be using those things, and then I'm going to be using my custom Wolf Whiskers brush. So let's just get this loaded up. Okay. Yes, this is a triple milled soap. We're just gonna load it up. Like I said, I'm gonna start overloading. I mean, I don't, I don't think I'll get through this in my lifetime. Cause I guess triple mill soaps they take a while. I mean, they well they last a while, so mm. stuff really smells good. All right. Um, cause I took a shower a while ago and I was waiting to do this review, so I put on some pre-shave, uh, the Phoenix Artisan Accoutrements pre-shave. We'll get lathering up. Get the blade wet. Let's go first pass. Let's see how this is.
I knew that was going to happen. Rinse my face off. I don't know why I put lather here because I don't do usually do that. I don't hit us with a second or I mean with a second pass or a third pass. But uh <clears throat> I'm just gonna just gonna rinse my face off and alright, pull shave. We're gonna use an album block. After shave we're gonna use the bomb. Now it comes in a metal container, which is Pretty cool, but if you well, let me shake it up. This kind of has a consistency of an aftershave with some lotion in it. So I don't know if this is supposed to be an all-in-one type thing, but it's kind of like along the lines of ginger's garden consistency like where it's it's an aftershave but it seems like it's a little thicker and it has some lotion in it well i'm really happy with this shave i didn't even i didn't think i was going to get this good of a shave uh it's the razor uh maybe my technique but the soap i'm going to give it a lot of credit a lot of credit all right well i mean I don't want you guys sitting over, uh, sitting over here watching me just massage my face for the whole time, amazed. But uh, that was my shave review, Spafinico, Spanifico Veracino, and it's the aromatic fern uh, smell. Like I said, it smells just like Curve, so I don't know if you guys are into Curve. It is a little pricey. I think uh, the bomb and the soap, and I got the wooden container, mind you was I think $75 uh, shipping included and everything from Bo uh, Bulgu Shaving. But uh, honestly, guys, this this stuff I am really impressed with. It, it, it's nice. It's really nice. Uh, Scent-wise, scent strength out of it was like a four. But then when you lathered it up, it really just, you know, came, came alive. Um, the Glide, this is definitely like a nine almost a 10 like let's say 9.8 uh cushion 9.8 i mean this stuff it feels really nice i mean my skin feels really really nice and moisturized you know guys if you guys are looking to spoil yourselves or anything like that i, I would definitely give this a shot you know it, it's seems like a good product and it, i mean it is a good product but uh either way guys i appreciate you guys watching Thank you for everything, and I'll see you guys on the groups. Bye.